Hello. Brought you guys water. Don't you want some water? Hello there. All right then. There's some water. Here's some food. Here's the extras. And it's a crab. Yeah. Tomorrow I'm back to work, so I'm not doing anything today. I just drove out here to give the cats water, make sure they had something to drink. Um, it's disheartening that everything's getting ready to turn green. Because if you understood what that meant out here, you would know that it means ticks and it means thickness everywhere. It will not be brown like this. You can't follow me. Update on the electric. AEP is demanding that my electrician comes back out. No, you can't follow me, stop. Um, the electrician has to come out and do the pipe bearing. So that's gonna be 14th. Update on the pine trees, they blew over a little bit. It's not surprising, but we'll get them straightened up. I'm gonna go on a walk, but I can't go on a walk because they're following me. And where I'm gonna go on a walk, the road goes all the way around like this for miles, miles and miles and miles. I'm gonna see if I can do it. But guys, you can't follow me. There's a male cat around here. He's trying to get you. Now I gotta lead you guys back. Come on. Okay, I'll put the cats back. They were just curious. So now I'm going to actually do this. I, okay, last time I measured it, it was almost, it was a five mile um, loop. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Don't you follow me, cats. Okay. They started following me. I never noticed, but somebody had put a sign on one of my trees, private property. I like that. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So this is what it looks like from up here. Oh, this is gonna be a long walk. It's all right. This is what it looks like from up here. I don't like a lack of privacy, however, in the summer it's a lot more private because all the vines are covered. No cats, you don't see me, you don't see me. So there's my neighbor's beautiful cabin. Really cool. They got a beautiful fence they put up here. They bring their dogs up and they have a super wide, super double wide fence. Entrance gate, which I love and am jealous of. Really pretty. Now we're way up on the ridge. If you look way over there, that's the ski resort that overlooks mine. He can see everything. I went in his house. This is my friend's lot over here. His name's Ty. He brings his motor home down and they stay. He put all these stones here. Beautiful. He did a lot of work. This is one of my favorite stretches here. It's just, this is the Deer Ridge. You're on it, looking down on everything. I like that little place right there. I don't know if somebody just bought this land and built it, but it's, it's really cute. I never see anybody there. Oh no, my cat's coming back. No, you're going to, no, get up. Come on, come on, get up, let's go. Now I gotta go back, you make me walk extra, come on. Come on. You're like a dog. Seriously, you're doing this? Literally, 
I was on my way. Come on, come on. I'm gonna have to lock them in the cat house while I do this hike. And you too, you guys are killing me, man. Okay, it's definitely over a five mile hike now. And you keep getting in front of me. Come on! This is my wa where my water is. Come on, we're cutting through. I'm gonna trap you guys in until I get back. You guys are like dogs. Come on! Okay, I got them all in there. And these are how you trap them in. I mean, these doors. I will let you out when I get back. I'm sorry. I hope you don't go to the bathroom in there. Okay, I'm back on my path without the cats. I love these pines here. They actually cleared them out. See, I thought about doing that to mine, but I don't like the lack of privacy. But it does look beautiful. Looks like a park, and I like how this road is down below this here. It's pretty cool. So we just passed a farm and uh, we're done with the cabin area. And there's this creek area. It's pretty deep. This thing really floods, I think. But we always see deer down here. Again, lots of ridges. You're down in inset from the cliffs. So this is like really an awesome place over there. It's like, whoo, look at that. That's just really cool. So you start to get in more, more of these country houses, but there's this cool church along the way with this sweet, sweet hill. like really high up. There's a road that goes down and around. Walk back down. Some really old tombstones up here. And some more gorgeous hillside like pastures and beautiful just houses but beautiful scenery look at that hillside it's just so gorgeous the kids up there playing football so now I'm coming across this place called this church over here safe harbor but house on the hill So this place up on this hill, I think it's abandoned, but it's like gorgeous. It's like beautiful resort, but it's all boarded up. The windows aren't punched out. It's been like that for a year. It's got insulation on it. It's like somebody started it and they couldn't finish it. Absolutely gorgeous. It's just so neat to see how the terrain changes and everything as you go. But I'm like at the halfway point and my legs are killing me. Or really, it's the bottom of my feet kill me because we have like kind of went down a hill and like straight and up a little hill. Now we're leveled out, but we're getting ready to go up the big hill and that's going to kill my feet. Look at this sign. Welcome to the ranch. That's so cute. Or the farm. I like it. They had fun. creeks on both sides okay so i just took the turn back there 
starting to walk up the hill. This little creek on the left. And what this is, it veers off to the right. That goes one way. My road goes straight. It's basically a gravel road. Okay. okay, this hill is a monster. It is killing my feet. Literally that hill is probably 10 feet above my head in person. This is an eight stretch. It like goes down and up. I always drive on this. You go super fast and fly through here. <laughs> okay, see that? That's the first cabin. Now we're back into the deer ridge. There's the cows. This is one of my favorite places down through here because it gets really low and the sides get high. Hello? Don't mind me. And there's that cabin again from a different angle. But look, you got some flooded water here. This place here has just went up for sale. That one was the neighbor to the property that my friend Doug was going to buy. See how high up that is? That is 20 feet above my head. It does not look like it. It is really straight up. If you want to buy this, you can. It's for sale. I walked that property with Doug. We plotted that out. I made a map of that. That's his neighbor borders what he was going to buy. It goes way back. It's like a big T-shape. More cows. Hello. Here's where I really love this. It's like higher up. And there's the cabin that Doug was going to buy. He was in contract. Decided to get out of it. I love this. All these trees make up Deer Ridge, goes around the corner. We're almost to mine, but it's just a really neat, epic way of coming in. I love it. So here was Doug's cabin to be, and this is us coming up around the, the curve here. Uh, he had a nice big wide entrance as well. But uh, they started staining that a different color, like a darker, like a darker, you can't see it. It's a nice darker brown, but it's too red. They should have made it a little more yellow. But this had a trail in it and it's overgrown. So I don't know if they bush hogged that down or not, but it was a gorgeous piece of land. All these beautiful pines, just in love with them. It's a magical place. I tell you, feet hurt, but great exercise. That's my neighbor Oakley, almost back. Ski resort is what I call this, because it's really high up. He's got a nice cleared off place here. And you can see my neighbor's cabin from there. Oh man, it's gonna feel good to sit down. And if you look hard enough, you can see my cabin right over there he's got a gorgeous place he's really worked hard to to like clear it off and build it he's got like uh, solar everything it's amazing inside of there it looks so small from here it is gigantic inside and you can see everything he owns 20 something acres all right we're back we're freaking back
Okay. <sighs> Made it. Made it. My feet are killing me. That's the loop. There's the pines. Everything's good. Okay, time to go. Ooh, okay, here we go. Let's keep 